Martin's divided into two sides, the Dutch side and the French side. This is interesting, a French restaurant, Lescargo, in the Dutch Quarter. We're now going to get the bus and go and find the French Quarter. As always, the public bus is the cheap option. You just need to know where to find it and where you're going. This is the local bus stop, so we have to look for the name of where we want to go, which is just written in the front of the bus. We're going to Marigot. Travelling towards the French side of the island, you can see the landscape changing. We're in the capital, Marigot, and there's more than just a French bill. People are wearing Lacoste shirts, everything's in French. It's got a very Antibes vibe. Marigot is the capital, and this is the Yacht Club restaurant. And this is the Fort Louis Marina, where all the posh yachts come in. It really has got a French feel to it. There's a laid-back, relaxed holiday atmosphere now, but in days gone by, you can just imagine the hustle and bustle of trade in this port. This was the area that needed to be protected. This is where you come to charter your boat for a day. There's a dive centre. This is a beautiful piece of art. It's a monument which was inaugurated by the first president of the collective of St. Martin and it symbolises a new departure for the island. It's absolutely beautiful. It's 30 minutes away on the ferry and it's got 22 beaches. Caribbean reversible doll that way or that way. <laughs> This view is amazing. Fort Louis was built in 1789 on the order of Jean-Sébastien de Durat, governor of St. Martin and St. Barthes. It was to defend the salt, sugar, coffee and rum. Shouldn't have worn fit flops. Should have put my trainers on. We're at the top of Fort Louis and the view is spectacular. It's a big climb, but it's worth it. The problem that the settlers had when they first arrived here was that people kept stealing their crops, so they built the fort to protect them. This size 18 cannon could fire at warships 800 metres off the harbour. Impressive, huh? They sailed all the way from Europe to fight here in the Antilles between the Tropic of Cancer and the equator. Wow! We're back in the Dutch Quarter again and it's so different, the feel from the French Quarter. I actually, I can't choose between them. This part is so structured and clean. The French part is rambling and like going to the Riviera. What a great holiday. You can have both of them and so close together. And just a short bus ride, $2. <laughs>